Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Subnautica. And today, I am going to be working on upgrading my prawn suit to get it a depth upgrade. And I'm also going to be heading back down into, like, the lava area and hopefully find this primary facility. So last episode, we got not really coordinates, but we got some information that tells us kind of the location of where this primary alien facility is at. So that's where I'm going to try and head today. But first, I got to upgrade the prawn suit's depth upgrade. Because right now, it doesn't have one. Uh, there's also a bunch of other upgrades in here that I might try and get as well. Like the jump jet upgrade. Because uh, that's going to be really helpful. But this is the main one that I need to get. So I've got a plasteel ingot already. I just need nickel ore and rubies. And it's all over here in the Cyclops. So I'm right now working on recharging all of my batteries. So while I'm making all this stuff, uh, all the batteries are going to get charged. The other thing that I wanted to do today is I wanted to get ion power cells uh, for the Cyclops. So I'm hoping to be able to make six ion power cells, but I'm not sure... Uh, if I'm going to have enough ion cubes to do that. Uh, I do have that big thing of ion cubes back at the uh, one facility that we were at last episode. So I could head back there with the teleporter and get some more ion cubes if I need them. Uh, but I'm going to do that later. Alright, so I've got seven ion cubes in here. So I have enough to actually make uh, all the power cells, which is good. Actually, maybe not. Because I think it takes 12, because it's 2 for a power cell. So it's going to take 6 ion batteries to make 3 power cells. So I need 12 batteries in total. So I'm actually going to need to go get a few more ion cubes. But I've at least got the depth upgrade built. So let's go ahead and put this in and see how deep this goes. I don't know, is there an upgrade to the, uh, the depth upgrade? Let me check. Because I would like to make that. There is. Oh, all it is is lithium and the kyanite. So you know what? Let me go grab that out of here. And let's upgrade this to... I think this is the max depth that it can go. Alright, so there is the depth upgrade made. Uh, let me go and grab two more power cells to start charging over here. Uh, so we need this one and this one to charge. That one's almost full. Alright, so let's start making some of these batteries. So I'm just going to make all of the batteries first, and then I'm going to make the power cells. Uh, so let's go ahead and turn all of these into batteries. Oh, I'm out of gold. Okay, so I've got some more gold and silver, so let's go ahead and make the rest of the ion batteries here. And then this should be seven of them, uh, because I had seven ion cubes. And I'm pretty sure this is all the storage that I've got here. I don't think there's any more. Because I checked the, uh, the Cyclops. So there's no more ion batteries that I have. So now I'm going to make power cells. I think I can only make three of these right now. Because I've got six batteries. So I can make three power cells. Which is going to be really good for the Cyclops. So all I need is six more ion batteries. And then I can make... Uh, the rest of the power cells. This extra battery is going to go in my sea glide because this thing eats power. So it's going to go in there. And these all have a thousand power compared to a normal power cell, which only has 200. That is really good. So I'm going to go ahead and take all these. And I'm pretty sure you can recharge these as well. So I'm going to take the power cells with me. And. Is there any other upgrades that I need to make before I get out of here? Uh, let's... Oh, I wanted to make the jump jet. Alright, so I can make the jump jet over here. I've also got the copper so that I can make uh, the wire, which is right here. So let's go ahead and make that. And why does it say I can make everything? Uh, okay. That's weird. I can't make any of that stuff, but... It says I can. Alright, so now that I've got that, I should be able to make the repair upgrade for the Cyclops. So let's go ahead and give this the jump jet upgrade. So let's head over here and build the upgrade for here. 
And I think that's going to be it uh, for upgrades. Uh, do, how much space do I have for upgrades in here? Uh, I've got two spaces left. So I could actually get the thermal module as well. But I'm going to have to get that another time because I don't think I have enough stuff. Uh, so let's go and put all of these ion batteries in here. There we go. So I've got all our power cells over there. And then these will just have normal ones for now. But that has got a lot of power. How much power do we have? We've got over 3,000. I don't know how much we had before with just regular power cells. But now we've got three ion ones. And eventually I'm going to get uh, the other three on this side. So we can have all six. Okay, so we're ready to head off to the portal. The only problem is I don't remember... What direction the uh, the island's in? I think it's over there. Uh, so I'm just going to keep going in this direction. We're going to go ahead and use full speed here and see if I can find the island. All right, so I found the island here. All I got to do now is find where the base is at. I think it's right here. Is this it? Yeah, this looks like it. Uh, I got to find a way of getting in. I think there's an underwater entrance, if I remember correctly. Alright, so we've got one of these guys over here, but there is an entrance. I don't know if I can get the Cyclops in here, but I'm going to try and see if I can park this thing inside of the uh, facility. So, here we go. Let's see if this fits. It looks like it fits. Perfect. Uh, so, let's go in here. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and park it, and then we're gonna go, uh, find the portal. I should be able to go through the portal with the prawn suit here. I'm not sure if it's gonna work, but let's go ahead and test it. Oh, uh, am I gonna have enough power to get out of here? Oh, no. I gotta go back down and recharge my jump. But at least I've got the new jump upgrade. Look at this. That's so much better. Oh, this looks really cool, having the uh, Cyclops inside of the alien facility here. So now i got to figure out where the portal is. I think it's through this door over here. Is this how we get to the portal? It is. Okay, good. So let's go ahead and walk through here. Hopefully the prawn suit comes with. And here we are. This is the, uh, the ion cubes that I want to drill. Hopefully I can get uh, six out of this because I need to make six batteries. All right, so I ended up getting 10 ion cubes, which is really good. So let's go back through the portal here, uh, head back to the Cyclops and make the rest of these power cells. All right, so I've got everything. I've got six gold, six silver, and 10 ion cubes. So I should be able to make all of these. I need to make sure I don't make too many. So that's three batteries. This is four, five, and this is six. That should be enough. Uh, yeah, so I'm out of all of that. So let's go ahead and make the ion power cells. And we need three of these. And then I should have full ion power for the Cyclops. There we go. Do we have any extra batteries? No. I don't really need the uh, the ion batteries uh, for anything. They're mainly used for the sea glide because that needs the most amount of power. But let's see how much we got now. 6,000. That is really good. And we've also got the energy efficiency module. So that makes it a little bit more efficient. So I'm going to go ahead and put the rest of the ion cubes in here. I should make uh, another purple tablet. Because you never know when you might need that. Because they seem to be used a lot. But I'm going to go ahead and take the Cyclops here. And I'm going to head back down. I finally made a beacon for once. So I know how to get back to the lava area. Alright, apparently we're a little bit stuck here. Let's just go ahead and go down a little bit here. And now we should be able to make our way out. Here we go. Uh, now I gotta head all the way down to uh, the lava biome, which should be over there. So let's just go ahead and 
back this thing out. And, oh, right, we're heading way too far down. We're going to start hitting the side of the wall. Oh, right. Okay, this is not good. We're starting to hit the sides of the wall here. All right, so I'm almost over to the beacon, which is where the entrance uh, to the lava area is at. Now, this is actually a different spot to where I was at last episode when I went down here, which was over by, uh, like, the big, like, blue tree. So this is actually back where we found the first, like, disease research facility is back over there. And then if you keep going through the cave, there's, like, this huge hole. And I actually found this before, but I never went down here and explored. We've also got this guy. Shields up. All right. Um, here, let's just go down here where it's safe. I don't know if it's really safe, but we could just, like, keep the shields on. There's also, like, more stuff to explore over there. There's a lot of stuff around here to explore. Probably shouldn't have turned off the shields because it looks like this guy's getting closer. Oh, great. Am I going to hit the side? This guy's getting really close. Shields up. Where is this guy at? Where's my cameras? Oh, he is actually, like, following me all the way down here. Okay. That's cool. Uh, let's turn this off because he looks like he's going away. So here we are down in the lava area. I just have to turn this thing around so that we can start going in that direction. Alright, so it's apparently south of the facility where we were at before. Uh, so according to this, south is like straight ahead. So inside of this huge area... Oh, great. Um, okay, we've got overheating engines and we've got... Oh, right. Is he moving the whole thing? What are you doing? Stop. Stop attacking. No. Okay, turn the shields off. This is why I like having the ion power cells. We could just have the shield on all the time because we've got so much power now. So if I keep going south, we need to go 1,400 meters. And that should be the facility, hopefully. If, uh... If I read the information correctly, it should be somewhere in this direction. Alright, so I found a, uh, a cave here that goes deeper. I don't know if this is where we're supposed to go, but here we go. Uh, let's see. Oh, what is this? What is this? There's even more lava down here. What? We're like at the planet core. Or s Hi. Hi. Kid. I am what you seek. Want to help you. Okay. Cool. Um, well, there's uh, weird cubes down here. We've also got these uh, weird, like, lava rays. Oh, what is that? What was that? Oh, no. And this guy's down here. Of course. Of course, this guy's down here. And he's coming straight. Oh, great. Shield's up. Let's get the shields up. All right, it looks like he's going the other direction. What is this? This place is huge. This has got to be the primary facility. All right, so let's go over here and let's park the uh, Cyclops. And let's see what is... Oh, I forgot to turn off the engine. Yeah, let's go ahead and turn off the engine. Uh, is there anything attached to us? No, we're good. All right, so I need to get some water... Before uh, we go, so let's drink some water. I'll uh, eat a melon real quick. And let's grab the prawn suit. Do I have my tablets? I do. It looks like there is a door here. Hopefully it's not a purple door because I don't have any purple tablets. Let's see. What do I need to unlock this thing? Oh, it needs a blue one. Yes, I have a blue tablet. Why is it orange? Okay, there you go. Oh, is that an ion cube up there? Looks like we got an ion cube. So, what was that? All right, I think we're good. Here we are. This is... What was that? I have no idea. Um, we've got... Translating local alien broadcast. Warning, vaccine development program terminated. Emperor egg fetching project terminated. Live specimens terminated. Evacuate immediately. Okay, that doesn't sound good. So can I drill this? 
Apparently, I can drill this and get iron cubes. I wonder how many I'm going to get from this. It looks like I'm just going to get three. Uh, so, let's go ahead and grab that. There we go. We got some extra iron cubes, which is nice. I've also got a bunch of these weird things over here. So, there's apparently a bunch of different things around here that we can scan. I'm just going to scan all of these. It's a lot of weird object. What is that? Um, hold on a second. What What is going on over here? I, uh, I took the ion cubes and now it's doing something. Is it like rebuilding the ion cubes? I think it's making more. So is this just like an infinite source of ion cubes? Okay. I'm just gonna keep scanning these things. There's like a bunch of rooms. There's like three rooms on each side. This place is huge. And then there's also that room over there that's like locked. Uh, can I scan this? There we go. Alright, we've also got the alien robot here. Apparently I've never scanned these guys. No! No, sorry, I just wanted to scan you. Okay, this guy's not happy. Uh, we've got two more cases to scan. This one has, like, nothing in it. It's just an empty case. I might as well scan it. There we go. Nanobots. Wait, there's, there's nanobots in there? Okay, well, let's go ahead and get inside of the prawn soup. But before I do that, what do I need to unlock this? I need another blue tablet. Alright, so the blue tablet is an iron cube and two kyanite crystals. Uh, luckily, I've got a infinite source of iron cubes, it seems like. Uh, there's also some data up here. And another door. How many doors are in this place? Alright, so I just grabbed this data, and it's apparently for Emzyne 42. Okay. We got some information on that. What do we have in here? So this is like another kind of like research facility, it looks like. Uh, something for like Emzyme 42. Uh, let's go ahead and grab the prawn suit here and explore some of these doors. See what's over here? What's behind door number one? Uh, apparently we got another door. Where does this lead? Oh, great. Another portal. Can I activate this? I can. Okay. So are these just like all portal doors that go to like different places? Like I don't even know where this one goes. Should I go through it? Um, here, let's go through it and see where it takes me. We're apparently at 300 meters now. So we're higher up. Where are we at? Uh, where are we at? Where, where is this? Um, I'm not sure where we're at. Are we on the other island? We might be on the other island. Uh, let's see where this leads. Oh, we're not even on an island at all. We're underwater. Okay. Where are we even at? I don't even know where we're at. This guy better not come attack me. Okay, so we're apparently here. Okay, let's go back and uh, see what's behind all the other doors. I'm assuming like each door is going to be like a portal that leads somewhere else. Why are you in the cave? No, you're not supposed to be in here. Oh, great. Right, we got to get out of here. All right, so I went into the second door here. What is this? Is this like a water park? What is going on in here? Um, might as well grab this. Um, we've got apparently a huge tube. Oh, wait, is there a lower floor as well? I can't even get up here. Okay, what is going on? We've got outflow pipe apparently here. Okay. So, we've got pipes that are flowing out. And then we got an inflow pipe. That is here. That goes down. Alright, so here's door number three. It looks like we've got another portal. So, this one I'm not going to go through. But I'm going to activate it. Uh, just so I've got it. 
Uh, eventually, I'll probably go through these at some point to see where they laid. But for now, I'm just going to activate them. I want to see what else is around here. Uh, but it looks like all these portals lead to a bunch of different places. I might as well grab up some more ion cubes because I'm using them to activate all these portals. And this seems to be like an infinite source of ion cubes, which is going to be really good. I can make ion batteries for everything. Alright, so I went in and activated that portal. So let's go to the next door, see if there's another portal in there. Let's see. So we've got two more doors left. This has... What in it? Oh! Okay. We've... This room appears to be a biological archive storing more than 40 indigenous egg specimens in different states of development. Okay, so we've got eggs. Like a lot of eggs. Cool. Uh, what's in here? Sea Emperor Leviathan Research Data. Okay. That's interesting. I don't know what a sea emperor is. But there's a bunch of eggs in here. Look at all these eggs. And I'm pretty sure you can, like, collect all these eggs and uh, hatch them yourself. Like, throughout the, uh, the world here, you can find them. Alright, so here is the final portal. Let's go ahead and activate this. And there we go. We've got a bunch of different portals that lead to uh, different places. I'm not going to go through them right now. Maybe next episode I'll go through them and see where they all lead. But at least we know that one over there goes to uh, some weird biome. I have no idea. Now we've got one more door here that's locked behind uh, this uh, key. So I need another blue tablet. But I think I'm going to save that for next time. So next episode, we're going to unlock this door, see what is back there, and uh, hopefully get some more information on what to do next. So I'm going to go and end the episode here, so make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Goodbye, everybody.